Hello, this is Old Crow Balthazar, and welcome to Balthazar Strategic Arcana. So this should be turn four of uh, a multiplayer game against M.D. Small, the creator of Balkan Variations. Now I'm playing the Entente. So there was a, a huge presence of Germans showing up in the East. French are thinking about mounting an expedition. I'm moving some forces in a headquarters unit down to the Med, uh, see if we can get into Albania. Because things are going to be pretty rough down there, I think, and in Russia. Britain's still not in the war. They're neutral, but they're getting ready. I'm also curious about what's going on for research. The British and the French have been pretty nice because we're not taking any casualties. However, the Russians, the Russians are in trouble. <clears throat> I did pour some money into uh, their industry that once it gets in effect, I'll be able to replace stuff, but that's out there. Not didn't go real hard on trenches. I might have to, but uh, we'll see what happens here. Yeah, static. Did he move something off? Yeah, he's gonna try to rush the fort. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah, surrounded. Brass little box is open. Another one that's around. Say, let's the rail junction. German units can be there. I ain't gonna be able to oust them. So the Bulgarians are gonna go up. They're gonna get a mobilization check. Well, I can't remember the percentage, but it's pretty good. Yeah, I left him there to die. <laughs> uh, had to gain a little bit of time. Yikes. It's time where I might have to consider soccer commanders. Interesting. Always replacing as you know, some new units on the line. Wow. Yeah, he's thinking of reaching all kinds of stuff. No, Nova Jadors is still up. Not making much headway, are you? I'm Serbia way. We've got that key mountain above uh, Sitinj. Sandjak horse. Ah. Yes. Come. Yes. Albania's in. Hmm. That's rough. Hmm. Okay, I got one coming. Let's go look at Russia. I gotta look at reports too about research, but Russia's survival. Yeah, so we have a mountain troops there. So usually we go to the Caucasus, but now not seeing anything. German Navy wise, right? <laughs> Let's look at. Uh, okay, it costs 22 to transport. Oh my god, I gotta get this guy out. Evert. He's actually not too bad as they go. Five. Now, when you compare him to uh, like uh, Ruski. 
General Ruski. Hmm. Do I reinforce? How much? Oh yeah, of course. Let's count that. Let's see. Oh yeah. That's what they're all about. And here at say let's know. Hmm. Let's go look at the reports real quick. I want to look at research and diplomacy. Let's look at the Germans. Yeah. Five sixty. Got a big pulse. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, no. Okay, that's probably entrenchments. Yeah, I spent some money on shipping stuff. We're going to change all that. That's entrenchments. Suburbs now. Yikes. Okay, so I got entrenchments going here, so that's good. One, one thing we got to do right off the bat. I'm going to detach you. All these guys in the front here. We're going to go into Bruce Love. That's it, yes. All right, second line. Let's get rid of you. Whoops. No, okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to entrench. We're entrenched. So we're going to do these secondaries here. Uh, I think the cavalry we can take off this one. Mm, yeah, he's going to try to get in there, isn't he? Need you. Cause I'm gonna I'm gonna sack you. I'm gonna give you a good. I need two good generals down here. Cost money. <clears throat> wow. Yeah, that's not good. You. Well. Get a you Saki. Corner off. I'm gonna keep you down it. I just brought my money down to a horrible level. Okay, so we're in trench here, so that's good. Let's see just what's cooking over here. Now he's going to go for Lutz. Hmm. I got to get you out. Not lose you. 36. God dang. <sighs> super bad. Super bad. Super bad. We got to get you guys out. Yep. I got to get you within command range. So. Yeah. So I can get you to. Brown Novici. So, how far can I go? Yes, I can do that. Okay. Wow.
Hmm. Oh god, command range. Yeah, I wonder. Okay. Do I got left 45 so I can still do two units I got a unit I can place I think it's wise to get you out all the way up anywhere where you're gonna hazard me boy Dig. Dig, I say. Oh, yes, let's dig. Is there a command range? Yeah, barely at Mittal. I need you to get you up here. Do I dare move? That's another 36. Well, I have one unit to place. He's got gaps. I don't want to go in there. I don't. I can't afford to take losses unless I got a. Might just keep that one unit in Moscow. Just make sure that we're covered here. Yeah, he's gonna. He's coming on hard. Yeah, that's what we want. I don't want to do him prepared attacks. And so Grodno. Ugh. Gosh. Who are you under? No one, that's right. That's going to open up a can of worms. Rawr, yuck. Can of worms. Do I stay? Yikes. Could do this. Yeah, he ain't coming too strong on here now, are you? What's our supply here? Okay, it's all good. No, we don't want to lose. We want to fight for Grodno. Man, he's going to be on my on me. Only entrenchment of one too. Let's do this. Let's feign a gap. Yeah. On the railroad. Okay. You have to give it up. Transmit three, yeah, that's gonna be gonna be rough for you. <sighs> Forty left. Oh my god. You're gonna come right behind me too. Well we could do do this. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, let's try this. Let's keep on the river. Uh, yep. That might be foolish, but let's see what's our command range. Yeah, 
Now I've got to strengthen this. Uh, I do get him out of place. Remember this. Let's go see where I could put him. Hmm. Actually, this would be a good place. Yeah, I think I'm going to save my money. The other place is right here, Vilna. Actually, Vilna. So let's cancel. Let's get you. Casey's. Uh, yikes. Yikes, 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 yikes. Man, I love these uh, detachments. If I can slow him down just a little bit, I'd rather than be able to trench him, but. Do I go there and sacrifice myself? He will have to stop and, you know, it might be an alpha strike, boom, boom. But then he gets to move. So. Yeah, he'll be dead. I don't really like throwing away my men that bad, that way. I really don't. Uh, what we could do, let's do this. Let's throw him there on the river. Okay, new guy. Vilna. Yeah, we'll build up behind here. <clears throat> now, I still got 40. Okay, and then we have this guy. Which I, like I said before, I'd rather have him down here, but I could start force marching him. How far can you go? One, two, three turns. I want to think about that. Yeah, that's not so good. Okay, let's, wait, let's, let's uh, reinforce what we got up front. That's going to be 22. Yeah, that's the price of uh, that is one point. Yikes. Okay, that's fine. Hmm. Let's build here. I have an entrenchment. Let's get our cavalry back behind there. This will blunt. Yeah, this is weak as hell. Let's get our... Do this. Yeah. Let's make sure they're entrenching. I, I, I'm assuming they are. I need this there, but you know, let's just make sure they're ordered to dig. Dig those holes already there. <laughs> uh, no, I want to, but now <clears throat> this is the thing if he breaks through here, he might put everything he's got, trap those guys. So I might have made a bad move here, but he does gonna he is gonna have to consider dealing with this behind his lines. So I don't know. Was it good, smart? I don't know. How much money out seven? Well, is there anything we can improve? Yes. Two points. There's your money, Russia. And we'll see what was Russia researching. Oh yeah, industrial tech. And production. One trench tech. So yeah, trenches just aren't going to do them any good in early war. I mean, they're going to be important, but uh, I think that just generating money from this vast empire, because it's got a huge industrial base, I think it's the biggest one, is the way to go. Look at that. He's got he's got all of his chips in the east for quick dismantling of Russia. Avoid. <clears throat> I'm going to lose NM sites, but back here in the Ukraine, there isn't. It's here. Here's trouble. Here. Yeah. It, and these guys, I can always fall back. Even if it's in the swamps, you can't just leave it alone. Let's see, what's the supply like? Yeah, I mean, even on the margins. It's uh, an idea. Okay. I'm going to leave the Navy alone. 
We're good. Let's see what's coming down the pike. Well, yeah, I can buy a Banyan troops too with the Russians, but fortunately, with this scenario, I ain't happen. Okay, yeah, Helsinki. Oh yeah, it's September nineteenth. I'm used to the wall, wall calendar. This is different. <clears throat> also, it's nice. I love wall, uh, world at war, but uh, it's nice being able to concentrate on one continent and not seven oceans. <laughs> seven oceans and five, six continents. <laughs> That's the way out there. That's super way out there. Yeah, my subs, when I get a sub, that's going to nice, so. Yeah, it's 15. We just got to survive it along. So, other and getting CC, the only other uh, leaders I get are Killer or Udenich. And I really want to put pressure on the, on the, uh, on the Ottomans. I want to make them pay for this. It's going to be difficult though. Let's go check diplomacy on. I think the check comes after Bulgaria. Yeah, they're already at 69%. Yeah, and they're going to get a check after he took Sadlitz. Yeah, the old stab in the back. Okay, let's do Serbia. They got 81. Now, one of the things I've been doing with Serbia is I sold my. Uh, yeah, he's going to have a hell of a time. I'm just going to go ahead and reinforce and we'll see what we can do about Albania let's reinforce our cores first yeah this has got to be just a one now can I purchase yes I can my neighbor doesn't have a beat up one but Serbia does and these oops Serbia come here come here yes Yes, I got two. And these are great. And I'll get them quickly. So we'll just do that now. <clears throat> Let's look here. Let's look at the British. They're at 89%. Two turns from now. Approximately, right? Turks are at 78%. So... If all goes well, um, the British will be able to go into it first and maybe even alpha strike them. So I've got a, got this port here. And I have these cores, but these are British. There's French. So I need to get French in now. I need him. Or no, that's British. Ah, that was dumb. I need to get you in there. And you're reading for but Let's go ahead and put you on a transport. I know it's going to cost, but I need to get guys in there right now. And how much is it? Let me 143. Yeah, well, okay, I can, uh, can't quite get in Toronto with the Dubai, but I can get them, get the French core in there. Okay, that's key. Okay. Uh huh. Mm hmm. I can go right through there. Yeah, I already seen you. Interesting. I have a port to fall back on. Okay, let's do you. You're our Albanians. Now there's a French. See, it's a Russian miner, but I think you can put Albanians on a French control. I can't remember, though. With HQ, we'll find out. The Albanians are a real interesting group, aren't they? <laughs> oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's do this. It's gonna, I'm going to make you make this a big thorn. Uh, yeah, I love that the, uh, that this is an alternate capital, which we advocated, or it was one version of fixing this whole deal. But anyway, this is this is good. This is good. Montenegro held out till 1916. You know, what a wonderful place. And it's in full supply. They can be with some of their Sanjak friends who are mostly uh, Muslim, I believe. Okay, let's go get that core in. Now, 
I don't think he's got a sub out, but we don't want to take a chance on that. Okay, let's stand by there. Yeah, I wish we had the headquarters there, but that's fine. As long as we can reduce French forces in there. And uh, we're going to want them over here against the Bulgarians. But let's uh, well, I could force march from the six. Okay, let's do that. Yeah, this stab in the back's gonna be brutal. Uh, and uh, Mike's uh, the Greek part of it might fire, so it means I'm gonna have units there. I'll have British forces in the area too, and I can always. Move now. I know it's dangerous. There, there's a possibility that Greece is going to go into CP hands if I make that decision. It'll be interesting to see how that works out. Okay, let's get you in a nice, safe, almost neutral bay. Uh, 143. Yeah, let's go ahead and insert troops. Let's go in all the way. One seventeen, yeah. You know what? I'm gonna save that. Uh, this. Let's go ahead and get all the aircraft. Yes. Now. God, we did attack him, didn't we? Let's go ahead. Let's go and see. You know what? Let's see if we can break this sucker. I got a supply of. Yeah, let's go see what he's got. There's his destroyer. See what kind of damage he's going to do me. Oh, uh, yeah. That's fine. Yeah, let's go kill something. No. Oh. Not even going to move. Right. Yes, we can get out. Hmm. Hmm. Does have a dreadnought? No, no, no. Let's don't get gritty. Let's not get too gritty. Now, if there's neutral ships, I think you can get through me. <laughs> you could always war deck me, too. Could kill me a heavy cruiser, but we don't want to do that. All right. Let's get you in there. Okay, so some dreadnoughts come out. I think this is, that's game or not. I don't know if it is either. I mean, the British are coming in. Can't touch him, but he could war deck me. And you can actually do some serious damage to some of my premier ships. Uh, all right. Fascinating game. Yeah. Let's get you. Uh, would the British go in there? No. I want to, but that might be a little pushing it. Okay, let's do this. Now, is this French? Can't get there. Let's make sure. Just paranoid. Okay, 
for the scores. Rather like, rather have you here. Just get you in the court. Yeah, I think uh, the Britons doing doing all the heavy lifting here. They have to. French can't get in yet. Couple turns, fine. Uh, I'm not worried about German U-boats, but I might as well leave them in port. Let's go. That's second court. So I'm kind of denuding what I was going to have in, uh, in France when we do get in. But um, the idea is Kirchner's territorial army. <clears throat> we'll keep over here. You're out of port. Let's... Uh, don't think that's necessary right now. Let's do this. Let's get you in. I need cavalry over there. Let's just go ahead and get you ready. Yeah, I can't see nothing. Can't fly. Uh, 227. I sure would like to get these guys all up to snuff. Because he might come out like hell on wheels. His submarines definitely will. Okay, well that just tells me right there. Yeah, his submarines. Uh, I'm going to do the industrial attack. 110. At least 117. Uh, decisions, decisions. Yeah, just totally different. Wow, look at that. Command control, 1 through 4. Infantry warfare, 1 through 4. Armored warfare, 0 through 4. Yeah. Well, we're over at 1. 1. I forgot what the Germans, I think they they got all this too. Uh, they don't have that, I don't think. That's going to come in handy, possibly. The French got uh, Phoebus Warfare 1, 2, I believe. Well, I can't get an artillery. The other one is logistics tied to shells. Hmm. But I think trench warfare is our game. Yeah, at least 17, which is fine. Let's go ahead, start. Yep. Yeah, like I said, I think that the increments of uh, he hasn't got he hasn't put anything out in North Sea, but yeah, the extra those extra turns. Yeah, I'm liking this guy out here. Uh, let's go over here. That's another traditional way to do a Alpha shot out here on cruise, which you could do just before we get in war. Yeah. Yeah, man, I feel vulnerable. Now, what do we got coming for the British? Let's see. Nice. Yep. All right. Yeah, when I get French over to Egypt, I am definitely going to, I'm going to put another one down there. I'm definitely going to um, uh, seriously consider sacking him. I mean, he's no good. You know, I can always bring these guys back up. Uh, has that got enough weight? Don't think so. Don't want to do Brussels or Belgium. Just morally reprehensible. <laughs> yeah, he still went stop. Wouldn't put it past him to go and attack, do a lightning strike, right? 
This is a good place for cavalry right here. If I have to do Belgium, I gotta hit it. I gotta get Liege. Let's put that guy there. Did they stay put? Don't need you. Need you. Don't need you. Oh, you just out, aren't you? Okay. Do you make sure we got uh, casting all six? No, oh, it's because of the most size. Okay, I understand what's going on. Let's move you up. So it'll be covered. Mm -hmm. Take you off, put you on, just in case. Now, France, 106. You got, we got four in entrenchments. 106, not enough to get an artillery. Enough to do this, though. It's just insufficient guns, I know. 106. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Could do any sub warfare. Help with the <sighs> da -da. decisions. Decisions. Command control. That'd be a wonderful thing, actually. Infantry warfare. Logistics. We're already at two. That's pretty good, actually. All right, got the British doing their spy stuff. Huh, should I hold the money and just get into this? We do have subs we could turn into some lethal stuff. Aircraft. Be kind of awesome. Well, well, well. I think infantry, let's see, what, let's see what's this, uh... Yeah, 10% per level. That's actually awesome. Let's go ahead and do that with our infantry army. Let's get that up to two. Yep, yep, yep. <clears throat> we'll get an artillery really quick here. I'm using my six. Americans are moving up 75. I believe they are golden. Should I? Hell yeah. Let's get these guys out here. They can be helpful. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna pull these off. They can get clipped by subs. <clears throat> uh, I just don't know. I mean, I certainly can use them down here, right? He put that guy out. This guy's weak. I hope I don't lose him. I doubt it. Unless they run to a mine, but we know where the mine is. Well, I do believe we got her. Uh, Britain. How much money they got? Is that zero? I was going to say I could move that one detachment out of here, over here. Kind of want to leave him there, actually, but I wouldn't mind dropping some stuff. Yeah, I'm going to need a core of her, too, just to move in there and harass him. I don't think I need to land. I think I can land. Let's see, if I do here, I can force march. The port said, let's see. Let's just fly here. Yeah, four now. Uh, I'd rather just drop them. Yeah. And we'll get that French guy. General French. Yeah, we can keep you on the railroad, but we could have an option. If we do this, we keep force marching just in case one, two-ish. 
You know, because we need all the money we can get, right? Let's do that. Okay. That's it. That's it for September 19th, 1914. Let's end it. I always have this feeling I'm going to freeze them. Ah. Second and third Caucasian cars will be able to transfer from Caucasus to Brest Lodovox from where they can be sent action against the Germans. Let's go view the map. Now, I don't know where they're going to drop. That's the thing. Are they dropping back here? Are they dropping right here? I don't want to lose them. However, I am weak. I'm going to go. I'm going to take them in Brest. Oh, wait. I'm going to do it. When will they come, though, now? Uh, let's take the notes. Oh, I see. Hmm. Yeah, this ain't going to slow him down. This is a speed bump. It's one tack. He'll be on this, but he can't do anything. But he could really hurt me, especially if they play out here. Oh, boy, what a big decision. Because I really... Let's see, go back here. Gosh. I really want to put the nads on him, not the other way around. <clears throat> I'm usually pretty good with Udenich, but he has to have the right units, plus a few cavalry. Are we going to get that this, that choy chance, though? He comes just pounding on me. Oh, boy. I'm going to take Brest. Brest load box. Okay, behind. No! Oh, boy. Oh, Britain's going to come in quick. That quick? You got stuff out there? Oh, geez. Well, then again, war is hell. Hmm. See, the Russians 183 because they made that decision having to deploy in their homeland or the Caucasus Mountains where they are Abkhazians, Georgians, Ossetians. Chechens, Russians, those two cores, they're not locals to here, or Mother Russia, at least not that, the other part. All right, well, we'll see if I made any good decisions here or not, maybe some good, some bad, uh, or maybe even indifferent. Uh, so anyway, till next time, uh, see you on the virtual battlefields. Have a good one.